Hello, how are you? A couple things for this week. Um, first of all, if you are not on Facebook or you have just been way too busy to even check, um, Pastor Tad has been reading some books for kids um, that your kids might enjoy. Um, for our younger kids, he's read You Are Special by Max Lucado. My kids loved it. They watched it several times while I was making dinner. It worked out great. Um, and then he's also reading The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe uh, for our older elementary and middle school kids. And he's doing chapter by chapter. And so um, he's kind of uploading those, I think, every day. So those are all on YouTube. And I will also leave a link in the comments below this video so you can check those out or your kids can. Um, this week we are doing, we're going to do two fruits of the spirit because um, it's going to take us a while to get through them otherwise. And it didn't, our family went through love pretty quickly. So um, we're going to do joy and peace this week. And I may give you more like a week and a half to work on them. If you did not start the fruit of the spirit lesson last week, um, I suggest going back and checking out that video um, so that you kind of know where all the resources are. But um I will again put the link at the bottom of this email or below this video um, for you to go on and download um, and print off the lessons for peace and joy. Um, there are three activities for each and this week I'm going to do something a little bit different because there's some materials um, that you need that you may not have at home. And because it's hard to go to the store right now, um, I thought I would just do that for you since I already do it for myself. So um, I have actually put together these bags. They've got um, some straws and some pool noodles that are cut up and balloons um, for you if you would like them. I also have this sheet that I found this week. It's basically a summary of the lesson, but uh, what it, I haven't seen anywhere else is that it has um, additional scriptures and it also has questions you can talk to your kids about the story. Uh, and then I also included um, two other stories, one for joy and one for peace, that you could also read if you're doing this um, multiple days this week. Um, you could read that story too and it kind of goes along with the theme as well. So I'm going to have these packets in a bin. Um, at the back door of the church just outside and you can um, stop by and grab a bag if you're planning to do this with your family. I'm also going to have in the bin some coloring sheets that are a little bit more advanced. I know our older kids, some of them really love to color. So I'll have these in there and you can grab however many you want if you have kids that enjoy that. Um, also, if you have um, a larger family, Feel free to grab two packets or um, grab extra resources that are just at the bottom of the bin for your whole family. So I hope this is helpful. I hope you have a blessed week.